Hey there, in this video I'm going to be talking about how to, how to create this astonishing effect reflection. Uh, it's a screen space reflection in Android and iOS. So it's basically for mobile devices. devices. Okay, let's get started. The first thing that you have to do is go to edit, project settings, and then go down into the rendering tab. It's under the engine. Uh, so the first thing that you should always do is in mobile shading you should always use deferred shading It's the I mean it's always been there, but apparently it's been reshaped for UE5 and it is Good right now. So to prevent a lot of headaches uh, Furthermore in development you should always be using deferred shading for uh, mobile devices Okay um, so if you are using different shading, then you'll have clustered reflections as well, which is good. It looks really good. So in planar reflection mode, it's always um, uh, set to usual by default, but you should have more P PR planar uh, reflection exclusive or mobile PPR. Doesn't really matter if you are porting a game, then. Uh, from PC, then you should have mobile PPR ex exclusive. If you are exclusively uh, creating the game for mobile, then um, both of them work really well. And then you should type global clip support global clip plane for planar reflection. This one's disabled by default, so make sure you go ahead and enable it. And then you should restart the editor. It will compile a lot of shaders, of course. Um, so, this is what we have by default. I mean, it has some reflections, cluster reflections uh, looks good, really, but it doesn't have a screen space reflection. So, we have to come here, type in plane, uh, planar reflection, and drag it into your scene. Um, so, this way it will show you how it looks on your scene so for example if I only want this place to have uh, screen space reflection so it's like this if you are not seeing this thing here the statue you won't be seeing it in reflection as well so keep that in mind it's a screen space based effect it's not a real planar reflection it's not rendering the scene twice uh, and it won't be having the same performance hit as well. It will have definitely a little bit of performance hit, so you should keep that in mind that it's gonna make your game look a little bit better, but the performance a little bit worse. To see how it will look in game, you should play the game or hit G on your keyboard to uh, make everything invisible and see it in action. Uh, so as you can see there are reflection screen space reflection which are really accurate uh, in the scene on the floor um, and if I don't see the statue I won't see the reflection too and everything will fall back to uh, reflection cube maps Um, and that's it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and if you did, please hit that like button and have a great day.